Miguel Angel is nervously pacing the room. These are his last moments as a Catholic. He has chosen to convert to Islam. After having prayed alongside the other faithfuls who have gathered at Omar Mosque, Miguel Angel makes his formal declaration of faith, his Shahada, in Arabic, in English, and in Spanish, under the guidance of his girlfriend, also a convert. For Miguel, this is about rediscovering the roots of Spanish culture under the Moors. We Latino Americans have Arab origins, so there are many similarities between our cultures. In a sense, I am not going into Islam, rather I am returning to Islam. Lisbeth, who has chosen Shuruk as her Muslim name, is of Mexican descent. During Sunday school at the mosque, she translates for the group. She finds that Islam has all of the qualities of Catholicism, but not its flaws. We don't have, um, as, I say, as I said, all the dogma around it. No figures, no images. Uh, it's only love, the love for God. And that's the, I would say that's the only, the only line. But the faith is there, the beliefs for the angels, the belief for the prophets, the belief for the goodness, the respect for the elderly, for the parents. Miguel and Lisbeth are some of the many Hispanics to have embraced Islam in the United States. Their numbers have grown since September 11th, but they're hard to quantify as many of these conversions happen far from the public eye. Islam has really spread in prisons. It started with the African Americans and spread to the Latinos. It's almost impossible to have any statistics on the number of Latinos converting in jail, but we know about some of them. And as you know, Hispanics and African Americans are the largest minorities in prisons across the United States. According to this association, their numbers range from 40 to 70,000 across the country. Every week in this mosque alone in South Central Los Angeles, a few Latinos come to convert. According to the Imam, many Latinos have found in this religion some of the values which were left behind when they or their families came to America.